The business plan is crafted by the former Rundu Town Council Acting Chief Executive Officer Sikongo Haihambo and his company, Namibia Business Advisory Services CC, on a cost recovery basis. Haihambo wants the Rundu residents and council to take ownership of the plan, which must outlive democratic political leadership change. And this was apolitical. Apolitical means it was not linked to a specific uh, political party but it was linked to the collective genius whomever can contribute from the side of council, from the side of management, from the side of whomever, because this is for Rundu. But however, what is contained in here should therefore outlive, should we happen to step out of office and new people come in to then continue with the journey that we have started. Rundu Mayor Gabriel Kanyanga says the town faces numerous challenges, including poverty, unemployment, and rural urban migration. Kanyanga described Rundu as a broken town that needs fixing by all stakeholders. Let me mention that Rundu is a broken town and it needs fixing. And it needs fixing from everybody that I'm talking about the politician, the staff members, and the resident themselves. It will not save us a purpose to have many plans in our hands and we are not, ex ex uh, we are not implementing what the documents are providing us. Launching the plan, Kabango East Governor Bonifatius Wakutumo praised the strategic plan as forward-looking, calling on the leadership to understand it thoroughly. It's one way to launch a strategic business plan, but it's another thing to put it in action, because this should be the roadmap in terms of service delivery to our community. I think we need to agree on that one. The town's population has exploded in recent years, projected at more than 100,000, largely attributed to raw urban migration. This has placed a burden on the Rundu Town Council to render basic services such as delivery of safety land, water and electricity. The ISBP thus seeks to bring about a harmonious working relationship between the residents, the town council as well as the business community. It also advocates for the town to introduce business initiatives and companies to create jobs and create wealth for the town. Chris Kupolo, NBC News, Rundu.